We've been very clear about what this agreement is about. It's about stopping uh, Iran from getting a nuclear weapon. But opponents like retired General Jerry Boykin say the deal will actually have the opposite effect. This is, in fact, a pathway uh, to Iran having a nuclear weapon. Boykin and nearly 200 other retired U.S. generals and admirals appealed to Congress in a letter last week to reject the deal. Boykin says the agreement also gives Iran access to more money to fund terror groups around the world. There's going to be a large amount of money, uh, $150 billion. I've heard estimates uh, over a five-year period that run as much as $700 billion. Uh, that is going to go into the coffers of a, a very rogue Islamic regime who is the biggest sponsor of terrorism. That means that Hezbollah, Hamas, and other terrorist organizations are going to get a lot of money, which they can use against their two primary enemies, which is Israel and America.